Hey guys, I just wanted to make a quick video talking about um, what five-star character I'm going to be pulling in, uh, or characters if I get lucky, um, in uh, Weathering Waves uh, since it's coming out next week. <coughs> um, I just have Brynwyn pulled up here because unfortunately I don't, or I did not get access to the uh, uh, CBT2. So I'm just going to use Brynwyn as my, as my source for information on these characters. Um, in terms of just letting you know who I'm going to pull for so you know who I'm talking about. Uh, so I'm going to assume, again, since I haven't played the, the CBT2, that most of these four stars you're just going to get. Either from, maybe three of them will be on a banner, will be on, I think, Jingyan's banners first, will be on his banner, maybe some are going to be another selection of three, or maybe all of them are going to be in the standard banner for the game. Um, and then you have the actual five-star characters. I believe the standard banner ones are uh, Kelcharo, Verena, Encore, uh, Jinyan, and Jin and Lin Yang. <coughs> My bad. Um, and then I think the first banner is going to be Jinyan, and then the next one's going to be Yin Lin. Um, or maybe I'm wrong. Maybe, maybe maybe they're both coming out at the same time. I'm, again, I'm not. I haven't played the the CBT two. And I don't want to give any wrong information since I haven't experienced it myself firsthand. Um, but out of the standard characters, because I know we hit the uh, the goal, we're supposed to get a uh, five star character selector. Uh, I don't know specifically how we're going to get that in game, but if we do get one, I just wanted to talk about which character I was going to pull um, with that. And uh, of course, uh, it's probably no surprise. Uh, I'm going to get Calcharo. I just. He's a lightning DPS. I just think he is really cool based on the, the, the video stuff I saw. He uses a big long sword. He looks like Sephiroth. Um, pretty cool. And I know he... I've heard that he pairs well with Yin Lin. And Yin Lin is so fucking fine, bro. Um, I can't wait to pull this. Pull for her. Um, I, again, I think her banner comes out after Xing Yan's does. Uh, again, I could be wrong. I think Xing Yan's is going to be the first banner. And I really want him to, if you haven't seen his animations, his animations are insane when he gets the dragon after he ults. I don't know if I'll be able to get both of them. Again, it's going to depend on how much currency and stuff we get in uh, this game when we start playing it. We'll just have to see. Maybe I can get both. Maybe I can't. Um, but I will I will be taking Yin Lin over Jin Yan. I just hope I can get both. Um, Verena is a healer. I've heard she's actually broken. But uh, I wanted to talk about her first because a lot of people are talking about it. Um, even though she's broken, I'm sorry, I keep burping. I don't think it's good to pull for her just because she's broken. Um, because just like in games like Genshin and in Honkai, um, especially Honkai because because that one came out most recently. But the, the healers that they start the, the start you with when the game first comes out usually are broken just because they're the first healers they've released for the game. Usually, and in most cases, the next healer they release clears the current healer by a mile. Like, I think in... I'm going to use Honkai Star Rail as an example because I think it's the best one. Um, who, who did they give you? You had... Um, uh, for your five star, you had Bailu, and your four star, you had um, the Nurse Lady. Oh my God, I can't believe I'm forgetting her name. Um, but you had her, um, and they were good. They were good, and 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 Bailu was the best healer in the game. And then the next healer they dropped, I think, was or at least the next five star healer was Luocha, and Luocha is still one of the best healers a year into the game. He still clears a, a lot of a lot of all the other healers by a mile. Um, he clears all the four star ones, and um, there are still better sustainers than him now. I think the and the only healer that clears him is Huo Huo in in Honkai Star Rail. So it's like, yeah, she may be the most broken healer right now, but that doesn't mean it's going to stay like that even for a short period of time. They could just release another healer um, very soon, and then it's just just blows Verena out of the water. So. Um, just because she's broken now doesn't mean she's going to stay broken. And I'm pretty sure I've heard from other people that some of the four-star characters are actually pretty good at sustaining. I think Taoshi is one of them. So you don't really have to pull for her if you don't want to. Uh, personally, I always prefer a DPS over a support in any of these games if I'm going to be given the choice. Um, Encore, Jingyan, and Jinglang. 
Um, I've heard a lot of people um, like Jean, um, Jean Jin. Jesus Christ, I'm so sorry. Um, Jean Jin. Her trailer came out. She's pretty cute. Uh, her moves are pretty cool. Um, she knows she does her, her Tai Chi stuff. She has her slow um, her slow movements and build ups and stuff like that. I don't, I don't know if she's really a slow character. I know I think Encore is a slow character. I think she does heavy hits um, with her puppets. Because I don't think she actually fights herself. I think the puppets fight. Um, and Ling Yan is a, uh, he's a fast fighting character. If you haven't seen his trailer, he's like a... What is he? I don't, don't want to say you're wrong. Is he, is he a kung fu? He's like a kung fu fighter. I hope that's right. But um, I thought he was pretty cool too. But just in terms of personal preference on characters I like. Again, this is personal preference. I'm just telling you what each of the characters does. You've got a... You got a, a damage dealer damage dealer damage dealer damage dealer and then a healer support um so again um just pull for who you like i'm pulling for cal chalux i think he looks the coolest <laughs> out of all of them and i like his fighting style um if you like lin yang's pull for him if you like john jing's pull for her if you like encore pull for her if you want verena pull for her as well um i'm just letting you know that that these characters won't stay the best in their slots for long. Um, or no, they, maybe they will. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'm wrong. Verena, maybe Verena will stay super powerful for a really long time. But just pull for who you like. Um, have fun with it. Enjoy the game. Um, again, this game isn't <laughs> like Genshin um, in terms of combat. Wa uh, combat. Um, this game seems to be based more on raw skill versus how good a character is. Um, so the better you are at basic mechanics and stuff in the game, you're probably going to be fine. Even if the character falls off, if you have fun using them, you can most likely still use them as long as you're not ass at the game. But uh, yeah, guys, I just wanted to talk a little bit about that. Um, I'll let you know who I will be pulling for um and yeah that's gonna be it uh if you like the video um subscribe leave a like uh tell me in the comments below um who you're gonna be pulling for what characters you like uh and all that good stuff but uh yeah guys that's about it for me